Hello everybody, my name is Alaris and I'd like to read you a story today called Moon Jump. Here we go. It's about a little boy called Kyle and Kyle loved to jump. Here he is jumping over the table. When he woke up in the morning, he jumped out of bed, then he jumped into the bath. Look at all that water going everywhere. Then he jumped into his trousers, then he jumped into his shoes. He jumped onto the chair and from the chair he jumped onto the floor and onto the sofa. On the way to school he jumped in the park and when he got to school he jumped in the playground. Look his friend's smiling at him, he's jumping so high. But best of all he loved to jump when his daddy took him upstairs to put on his pyjamas. Then he would jump, 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 jump on his mummy and daddy's bed. One night, Kyle began to jump higher and higher and higher. Look, his teddy's jumping with him. And then with one great, enormous leap, he jumped out of the window and all the way to the moon, past the stars. When he landed, he met a moon man. How did you get here? The moon man asked. I jumped, said Kyle, with my teddy, of course. I like jumping too, said the moon man. Shall we jump together? Yes, please, said Kyle. And they jumped and jumped all over the moon. Then the moon man said, why don't we jump over to my house? So they did. We can have tea and cakes and strawberries and cream. Look at that strange house, that moon house. Oh, yes, please, said Kyle. And they jumped all the way over and had tea and cakes and strawberries and cream together. Kyle said, I feel sleepy. It's time to jump home then, said the moon man. Kyle waved goodbye and jumped really hard as best he could. And you know what happened? He jumped so hard that the next thing he knew, he was landing on his mummy and daddy's bed. His daddy said, oh, there you are, and gave him a great big hug and tucked him into his bed. Daddy, can I jump again tomorrow? Kyle asked. Yes, of course you can, said his daddy, and Kyle fell asleep. So I hope you like that story. I'll read you another one soon. Bye!